What's going on guys? Back at it again with another YouTube video. Dad's doing a drive-by. So, that's what's up. Five, four, three, two, one. Go. <laughs> G'day and welcome back to the channel. This is the final episode for the Model A V8 pickup hot rod build series. So I've put together a little collage. Um, we take it for a drive and uh, just let me show you around before that happens. So the deadline was September and I've smacked it smacked it good um, the videos have been well behind where I've actually been I've done a lot off camera and um, I just needed to get it done and she's done she's on the road it's come up really good I tell you what it's um, been a while since I've driven a side valve V8 and the thing goes so well compared to a Model A um, it's obvious why they're so popular it's just when I've been driving bangers, it'll force it on the bangers for so long, and then you get into one of these, the thing, it goes surprisingly well. It's not a drag car, but yeah, it feels like a V8. It goes like a little V8. It is a little V8. Here's a little video of the first time I started it up and actually moved it. The first time in its ever history, because this car's made up of lots of different cars, so the first time this has ever been moved under its own power, this is it. She's running the thermo fan, which is just on with ignition, it's fine. 12 volt alternator with a built-in reg. Uh, electric fuel pump, which I'll bring you over this side. All the wiring harness is brand new, I showed you in that other video. Really nice little electric fuel pump. Um, the original Model A fuel tank to the 32 firewall, and it worked out really, really well. Um, what haven't you seen? I uh, added the strips in the bed just to finish it off. They look better, it saves the wood underneath as well. And um, I think that turned out pretty cool. Painted in the same color as the, the car. The new windscreen's in. The other one had a crack in it and I had to replace it. I was sad because it had all the stickers of all the runs I've been at. Um, but I've still got the windscreen. I'm just gonna use it as a display. But we've got a clear slate now for new stickers. Cool little electric wipers, they work okay. After sorting out my headers, and I'll show you that in a second, I ended up deciding to get the exhaust professionally done and they've done an awesome job just some glass pack hot dogs and I think it's like an inch and a half inch and three quarter yeah inch and three quarter pipe but it sounds really good you'll hear that when I take it for a drive just dumps out there and don't look too close to the worlds but I had to completely change that pipe there so it worked it works it works good yes I had to put cycle guards on it for Rego but I disrespect these, so I've just left them as they were, all faded and yuck, because I don't like them. And they can stay faded and yuck, but they're a requirement, so they're on there. They were on the mongrel. What I'm going to do is do an edit of the mongrel, a video I did quite a long time ago. Um, it's similar to the video I'm doing today, and I'll probably publish that after this one. And uh, you'll see how common the parts are in between because a lot of this car came from that car that car's turned into three cars Doris this and then my coupe that's in the shed still so it's the car that just kept on giving and I had a lot of fun with it but yeah let's play the montage
so there you go. I hope you enjoyed that. What's next? Well, I've got little bits and pieces I want to do to it, um, but it's it's ready. I can drive that thing now anywhere. I'm pretty happy with the way it goes. It feels good. It's, it's tight. Handles nicely. Um, it drives like you know a car that's nearly 100 years old, but um, it's good. It's tight. Next, I don't know. I've got a few ideas I want to do to the Chevy. Um, I want to put another motor in that. We might do that. I want to build my VG hardtop. I want to do that. I want to stick a new motor in the BA in the BF Ute. Um, it works. Turbo motor in that. So that's all stuff that's going to be happening. I've got some work to do on the V sedan. I've got my little Daihatsu scat still. I've got lots of stuff. I've got more hot rods I want to build. So it doesn't end. It doesn't end here at all. I hope you've really enjoyed this series. I've enjoyed making it, and um, I've enjoyed the feedback, the comments, the likes. Um, it does motivate you to really push and when you're having a bad day um, you know you've got to get the, the videos out because you've got people waiting for them and they do people ask and I love it, it's great so I just want to thank everyone that's um, been involved on that side of the camera the other side, thank you very much but anyway that's it from me, stay tuned be good to your mates, like, subscribe, all that stuff and I'll see you on the next one cheers